So I was I was contemplating this question the other day, and I and I kind of want to present it to you, see what you think, yeah. and then I also give my thoughts because I I didn't share this publicly or anything. Right. But I was thinking about okay, so if you were given the opportunity to go back in time, like let's say like ten years, you know what I'm saying, right. with the knowledge that you had now, obviously most people would be like, yeah, I would do it, but the stipulation is that there is no like going back and there's no guarantee that life will look how it does today in 2023. If you go back to 2013, like you would just have to, you would have to go back there with the knowledge that you have, but butterfly effect, nothing would actually turn out how it turned out today. You know what I'm saying? Like the, the trajectory of life would go, it, it would start anew. You know what I'm saying? From let's say 2013, would you do that? Well, one, yeah, I would. Um, not to say I regret shit, but like I think it's already fair. I think it's kind of assumed if you go back, you gotta know it's not about to be the same. Mm -hmm. Like if you could, mm -hmm. you gotta know this shit. Like why would the fuck would you go back? That make this shit shake right now. If yeah, you yeah, go yeah. Back, it's different. I'm sorry. So what I for sure with the same mind that I had for sure, bro. What would you? What would you go back and do? I, I, I what what would be now, your first now, order of the business? Thing, this is the thing. This is the thing. I can't necessarily tell you the course of action or things that I would do, right? But I will tell you, I guess. Um maybe mental tools that I do have now that I would have really- What would you utilize, right, I guess? Right? Yeah, like what um, what have you learned in the last decade or like what do you know now that you would apply um, one, to that time? One is uh, my sense of conviction is for one. Like when I really mm. have a hunch or a really strong sense of something, I will not lack. I will move with an urgency. Um, what does a hunch feel like to you? Because I feel like sometimes, I feel like that's interest, that's an interesting thing, but that makes me think, even today when I be having hunches, it's like I move, but I'm I'm trying I'm looking for some sort of validation in my movement. You um, know what I'm saying? I, I guess whereas like back then you there's no guarantee that you'll have that validation. Right. I guess it, for me it's as if maybe you're faced with the task and maybe you're like, This is what I want to do, this mm -hmm. is what I like to do, but maybe seeing what it actually requires to complete the task. Maybe you put that shit on the back burner because it's too intimidating. Mm -hmm. It's too difficult. Mm -hmm. I want to do this, though, but maybe, maybe there's no you, maybe you can't see the outcome. Maybe later. Or I literally I really don't even know how to get yeah. to my outcome. And that is or you don't know if the outcome will be worth like, right, the, you right. know, what I'm saying you don't know if the juice is worth the squeeze. Right. All, all real things you could think, but kind of all kind of excuses. Don't. Yeah. Yeah. Because inevitably, look, you, you, end up you doing either you do or you don't. But you let couple years pass just to okay here we are back at this score like you're revisiting a square one you're like oh i was i was here uh, a couple years ago yeah. here i am again like yeah. all right let's not do that again yeah um so yeah one thing is kind of like that that sense of conviction um really following that um one thing i'd say still working on now but one thing i really even if, even if a nigga went back more than 10 years ago discipline like mm. maybe like really make that like the fucking like my fucking model. Yeah. Like really kind of like shape everything. Everything really is a byproduct of your how discipline or discipline. lack of discipline yeah, you yeah. are. Yeah. Early. Early.